I've laid out my work area to begin my painting with my tubes of watercolor paint above, the paper below. I have done a very light pencil sketch and then I begin to lay in some blue in the shadow areas to define the areas that I'll be working on in the painting and to establish an initial contrast before adding some warmer tones, some diluted burnt umber or some ochre and playing the warm tones off the cool tones and letting each layer of paint dry before going on to the next step. I continue by adding further darks in the darkest areas and beginning to work on some of the middle tones, leaving the figure for the moment to be worked on later, but establishing my large areas in the painting. The horizon has already been defined by the trees and I began to add some color into the water, some blues and some greens, being careful to save the reflection, as I am also careful to save the white areas in my painting, the very light areas that I want to still be there at the end of the painting. I put in one layer of color for the sky. Sometimes I add a second layer, but in this painting I only used one, and I began to work on the figure walking on the beach. I also continue to work in the middle tones, adding some greens into the middle tones of the landscape and continuing to add some further darks into the darkest areas, as well as strengthening the colors in the water. Then I began to work on the figure, bringing the figure into the same tonal range as the rest of the painting and adding some contrast to bring the small figure out of that large background landscape. Finally, as I approach the end of the painting, I add some more colors in the middle tones, particularly greens in this case, and I go back and add some very dark, small details in the darkest areas, and I add some other details such as splatter on the beach, and the painting is finished.